Hey everyone. Um, oh, hey Flackers! Sorry. Yeah, Thursday came out really bad. Like, the sound and the talking and the movement wasn't. Yeah, that pisses me off to no extent. Um, I had to stop like two minutes before the episode actually ended. Like I said, it was 1 30. I was like, no! So guess what? I'm going to do the episode I did Thursday again, and then I'm going to do the next episode for today. Okay. Okay. So, it's Tuesday, March 4th, which means it's time for the stick of truth that came out today. I probably won't get it to my birthday, but if any of you have got stick of truth, It's Tuesday, March 4th, which means it's time for... not that episode. Episode 48, Rise of the Secret Beast, Part 1. Presented by Wells Fargo. Sydney needed some financial guidance so she could take her dreams... Okay, the now time. there's less so we about her options. Her valuable assets were staying, and selling her car wouldn't fly. We helped Sydney manage her debt and prioritize her goals so she could really turn up the volume on her dreams today and tomorrow. So let's see what we can do about that. We love motorcycle. Yeah. Some questions take more than a day. They take a bank direction. Okay. Making my financial priorities important to them because when people talk, great things happen. Hmm. <laughs> oh crap. It's starting from where I left off. <laughs> Go, Chavs. I'm out of this. Yeah. You know what I love is that they're tilted. Like they've been underground for so long, they're just like that. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, this is happening. 
He just ran into a fucking branch. Everyone accuses him, even though it's not against his fault. Atticus just fucking goes like, um, uh, it's just like, oh god, Chaz, like, it's not fucking his fault. Then he gets hit by a backpack twice. Sydney needed some financial guidance so she could take her dream to the next level. So we talked about her options. Her valuable asset for staying and selling her car when fly. We helped Sydney manage her debt and prioritize her goals so she could really turn up the volume on her dreams today and tomorrow. So let's see what we can do about that. We love motorcycle. Some questions take more than a day. They take a banker. Make a my financial priorities come to me because when people talk, great things happen. <laughs> No crowds. I built this school, and now I return for my sacred beast clothes. Wait just a sec there, test two. Okay, <laughs> you want them? You gotta get through us. That's how this works. Oh, I am Kagemaru, master of the shadow games. It was I who first sealed the card oh. here. It was I who gave Shepard the seven keys. Alone they are worthless. To unlock the spirit gates, all that is required is fueling energy. Energy you expend trying to protect those keys. Uh, see, this isn't the chance's fault. This is why I arrange for 
all the best tourists in the world to come here. I hope you're happy. Glass after glass, a student would arise with an appealing spirit to unlock the power of the cards. My shadow riders were sent to test you, and only one passed. One with the potential to finally unlock the sacred beasts and give me the strength to rule the world. A cute story. So why all the tricks? Were you too weak to get the sacred cards for yourself? Lexus, don't make the scary man mad. You don't look so tough. More like some kind of reject science project. Listen up. There is no way you're getting those beast cards. Not so much. That's just like, I was thinking. Got that, Kagemaru? You'll have to duel me for that. Back off. It's my duel. And I'll jazz you up big time. So let's go. No way. He's all mine. After all. Badass, he blew it. He transformed me. No, don't explain it. Don't explain it. It ends with he's an old friend. At Discover, we treat you like you treat you. Free FICO credit score. Get the it card at discover.com. Sydney needed some financial guidance so she could take her dream to the next level. So we talked about her options. 
her valuable assets were staying, and selling her car wouldn't fly. We helped Sydney manage her debt and prioritize her goals so she could really turn up the volume on her dreams today and tomorrow. So let's see what we can do about that Remodel. motorcycle. Some questions take more than a bank. They take a banker. Make a My Financial Priorities appointment today because when people talk, great things happen. Make your move. All righty, let's go. I summon for Stinatrix in defense mode. And one face down. Now let's see if those beast cards are all that. <laughs> yes, let's. I shall begin by placing three trap cards face down. Three trap cards? I think this guy's got his circuits crossed. Uh, what do you mean? When you lay face down cards, you never have to say whether or not they're trap cards or spell cards. Oh yeah, right. Unless you happen to be summoning a sacred beast. Good. You know, I always wanted to see one up close. <laughs> more careful of what you wish for. I sacrifice my three trap cards to summon the first sacred beast, Uriah, Lord of Searing Flames. Hey, what's happening? Something very bad. Oh, on second thought, maybe I don't need to see it up close. I'm sure you're fine. No, hey, no they're not, you asshole! You look crazy. Crap, you can't look crazy. Yeah. They look like the bad parts. Whoa. All traps are useless against my sacred beast. And are destroyed. And if you were curious as to Uriah's attack point, he receives 1,000 per trap card in my graveyard. And at last count, I have three for a total of 3,000 attack points. Now, reduce Burstinatrix to slag. Hyper Blade! <laughs> Your turn, Jaden. Turn for what? The monster's too powerful. What can Jaden do? Oh, man. Oh, this is it. I waited my whole life to do the best. That's why I came here in the first place. Now, I got the best. And I'm staring him down in a duel to take over the world. What more can any kid want? What kind of cards we got? It's not gonna make a difference, dude. What's Jaden thinking? With Bubble Man in attack mode, he's got no defense. He can't beat that monster anyhow. Can't watch this. Why not? This duel might be the last thing we see. Come on, don't give up on him yet. All right, next I'll play polymerization, and I'll fuse my Bubble Man with. Elemental Heroes, Avion, and Sparkman! To form Elemental Hero Tempest! <laughs> he still doesn't have enough attack points to destroy Uriah. Not right now, but that's why I got this to help even the playing field. You know, maybe even isn't exactly right. Check out... Skyscraper! Thanks to this, my hero gets a wing up on you. If 
he has less attack points than your Uriah, Lord of Searing Flame, whatever, he gets an extra thousand points. Investment, show him who's boss. That's a hit. He did it. Yeah, but I would have gotten rid of the last round side. Impressive. I see I made the correct choice in selecting you as my opponent, Jaden Yuki. Your doing spirit will serve me well, as I rip it from your body and use it to acquire the power of the sacred beast gods. <laughs> I kind of like my dueling spirit right where it is. So let's see how you handle a face down. Uh, and let's see how you handle this. I activate Uriah's special ability. I merely send this trap card to the graveyard, and then... <laughs> As Lord of Searing Flames, one of Uriah's special abilities is to be resurrected when I discard a trap to the graveyard. What's worse? With another trap card in his graveyard, it gets a thousand more points. And if Jaden doesn't do something to get rid of it, he'll be in the graveyard next. Hey, where's Ruth? Right here. Yeah, owner saved so much on his car insurance from Geico, dude wanted to commemorate the moment with a glamorous photo. Don't steal, Mr. Tinkle. Don't forget old Caddy Wumpus now. Oh. Geico. Fifteen minutes could save you fifteen percent or more. Tell me about your relationship. Well, we're perfect together. Butter and chocolate. Nut butt and taco. Oh, yeah. He says when something's good, why change it? Exactly. exactly. <laughs> what if you were to try something different? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's Mr. Butterfinger. <laughs> I'm sorry, what are we doing here? <laughs> it's a whole new way to love peanut butter and chocolate. Smooth and crunchy Butterfinger peanut butter cups. Oh, man! Let's get out of it. Uh, I'm good. Nestle, good food, good life. What does everything mean to you? With the Quicksilver Cashback Card from Capital One, it means unlimited 1.5% cashback on everything you purchase every day. It doesn't mean everything as long as you buy it at the gas station. It doesn't mean everything until you hit your cashback limit. It means earn 1.5% cashback on every purchase, every place, every occasion, all over creation. That's what everything should mean. So consider, what's in your wallet? Now say goodbye to your feathered friend, Jaden. Hold on, test tubey! What? I got tricks too! By sending a card to the graveyard, Tempest can't be destroyed in battle! And we'll follow up that act with our next performer, Ha! One of my faves, Pot of Green! That's two cards for me and a whole lot of pain for you, because I'm playing this, Heated Heart! It gives Tempest 500 more attack points, which is just enough power to take out Uriah one more time! Oh, 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 oh. Waste your 
turn, Jaden. As long as I have traps to discard, my Lord of Searing Flames will never be destroyed. And now, I'll use my pot of greed. And then I'll activate the field spell, Fallen Paradise! Not only is your skyscraper obliterated, but this new field enables me to draw two additional cards every round, which gives me just enough to lay down three spell cards. Huh? Three spells? Great! Huh, I see. Despite your grades, you are a quick learner. Now I sacrifice these three spell cards to summon the second sacred beast. Come on, Lord of Striking Thunder. Look, we see it. Now about that boat. Huh. Come on, attack! Let's show his tempest the real stone. special ability. Should he destroy a monster, you suffer an additional thousand points of damage. <laughs> oh, don't worry. It won't hurt me. Jaden! You okay? Draw their strength from dueling spirits, but not merely from the players. They absorb energy from the very cause themselves. That's why they were locked away. These beasts have the power to destroy every card on the planet. Impossible! Oh. No, this can't be happening. But hold on. Jaden's cards aren't affected. Jaden's dueling spirit is beyond all of yours. Time and time again, he has proven the courage and heart to win, no matter what the odds. It is this force alone that can tame the sacred beasts and harness their awesome power. So that's why you want me? Yes. Once this shadow game yeah. ends and you yeah, lay defeated, I shall take your spirit. Finally, I will have the power to become the new master of the sacred beasts. Then, they will absorb the energy of every tool in deck across the planet, giving me enough strength to rule the world! Allow me to demonstrate a mere fraction of their power! Yes! Yes! Rejuvenate me! Oh!
episode 48, Rise of the Sacred Beast, part one, in like two minutes. We'll watch Yu Gi Oh! GX, episode 49, Rise of the Sacred Beast, part one. So, yeah. Oh, let me pause it. Ah!